Okay, my favorite candidate to break out this season is Equinemia St. Brown, wide receiver out of Notre Dame. His rookie season saw a lot of promise and I love his skill set compared to the other receivers in the room. His 2018 flashes are cause to be really excited, but coming off a season ending ankle injury won't be easy. He's been working out like crazy over quarantine according to his social media, so I'm really looking forward to seeing how he bounces back from that injury at camp. Kingsley Kiki is the next player I'm looking forward to watching at camp this season. He's got a big opportunity to step up and help the Packers de-stop the run and be that pairing we desperately need next to Kenny Clark. After a season under his belt, I want to see what kind of jump he's able to make. Josiah DeGuero was such an interesting and unexpected player selected in this year's draft. I'm going to have my eye on him, how many snaps he's getting at certain positions, and how Matt LaFleur uses him in camp. After Jair and Kevin, there's a lot of room for some other guys to step up and make an impact. We took Josh Jackson in the second round the same year we drafted Jair, and he has yet to see much playing time. This is his make or break year in my opinion, so I definitely will be watching to see how he looks in camp and who he's playing with as a sign for where he'll fall on the depth chart, but I haven't given up on him yet. My last player to watch is Raven Green. When he's healthy and on the field, he really makes an impact and he has a huge opportunity to be the kind of hybrid safety linebacker that Petten can use and be a really valuable player for this Packers defense.